Six, it is Psychic Zoe joins us for a Tuesday morning, 83001023. That is the number to chat to one of the world's best psychics, well, according to me anyway. Uh, give us a call, 83001023, to chat to Psychic Zoe. Is there someone you need to get in t- contact with? Have you lost your keys again? <laughs> Whatever it may be, the Psychic One is here, 83001023. It's 807. Three, Tuesday it is at 810. Good morning to you. It is John, Jody and Zoe, Amber, our special guest this morning, and also joining us too. For Tuesday, the one and only Psychic Zoe. Good morning, Zoe. Good morning, guys. Good morning, morning, Zoe. Now, before we get into it, you can catch Psychic Zoe coming up at a special show in Mount Barker, and Hackham will tell you more about that just before 8.30. But yo. Zoe, can I ask you about the uh, new program coming up on Channel 7, The One? Will you yes. Will you be watching it? What, what do you think of it? Or what, do you, what do you know of it? Um, okay. Well, a few years ago, I did uh, get into the first show, into mm-hmm. the finals. Um, this year, I really haven't had much to do with the one. I actually think it's going to be fantastic to display mm. Australia's talent. Um, and, you know, I think the criteria is pretty reasonable. So I'm going to be supporting them and watching them. And you would know who has won it by this stage. Of course, <laughs> you can, you can <laughs> see all. Sneaking suspicion. Oh, yes. oh yes. all right. Hey, we've got Deborah on the line for you from Strathalbyn. So go ahead, Deb. Uh, Zoe's listening. Yeah, Deb. hi, Zoe. How are you? Good, good. Thank you. Good morning. How sure. can I help you? Um, yeah, I've um, got a uh, few interviews to do today for a position that I've got available and I'm tossing up between two girls and, yeah, I'm not sure which way to go. I'm just wondering whether you could give me some insight into who would be best for the mm. couple. Okay. Yeah. So you're interviewing people for a role, is that what you said? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, to me, I kind of feel like I want to go with the person that's got fair hair. Um, I'm not quite oh, sure if really? this- the person, here. <laughs> okay. The young. I was going to say a younger person. I feel like someone who's a little bit younger, uh, someone who comes across sort of reasonably bubbly. But I actually feel like this person's very organised, very articulate, um, administrative. I feel like this person's a great sort of micromanagement. So there really does seem to be someone who's a great sort of PA, um, someone who I do feel like it's definitely going to be there for you. So the younger sort of, I don't know if she's even shorter and a little bit more petite, but definitely bouncy, yeah. bubbly, blonde. Yes, it's exactly who, yeah. Oh, was Zoe. Who, that was who I was waving for. There you go. Oh. Oh. Psychic Fantastic. Zoe recruitment right here. Problem solving. <laughs> <laughs> Good on you, Deb. Hope it works out. All right. Okay, Carmel. let's go to Carmel at Murray Bridge. How are you doing, Carmel? Yep, doing well. How are you guys? Good. 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 So you're at a bit of a crossroads with your life. Yes. Um, my two children are both grown up and left home. Um, I've been in the same job 15 years, same house 19 years. And I've got the opportunity to get a lump sum payout and start again. Okay. And I've got a few opportunities and options, and I'm just sort of stuck in the crossroads with all of these little okay, little choices. Saying, Go here. Yeah. Okay. Well, the first thing that comes to my mind, which is really interesting, is I feel like there's something to do with either cleaning or hospital around you so I'm not quite sure if there's someone around you that's thinking about starting a very small business or um, I kind of keep seeing dark haired lady around you so someone short with dark hair who's talking about a cleaning business connected to do with medical I think that's a yep. great option um, I think it's freedom I, I feel like you're a leader not being cheeky I feel like you're a leader so which means that this is a perfect opportunity for you to restart I do feel like the package is going to be probably about sort of seven to nine thousand more than what you expected dollar wise yep. so I really feel like that's fantastic um, I, so career Career-wise, actually, see so you being self-employed or self-contracted within the next sort of six to seven months. Also, very quickly, do see European travel around you as well. So, I really yep. think that's going to be fun. Also, keep seeing a male around you who's a bit grouchy, but definitely got a good heart. <laughs> <laughs> that's got to be dead. <laughs> <laughs> All the best for that, Carmel. All the best. Eight three hundred one zero two three. We're taking your calls now. If you want to chat to Psychic Zoe here at Mix one zero two point three, it's the Mix one zero two. It's Adelaide's best music. Is it the look in your eyes? On Mix 102.3. We're John, Jody and Snowy. Amber sitting in for Jojo and this morning Psychic Zoe joins us. going to be at the Mount Barker Golf Club on the 22nd of October from 6 till 8 if you want to go and see Zoe there. And also at the Hackham Sports Social Club on the 13th of November. All those details will be in JR's backyard this oh, Friday. Oh, indeed. Uh, we have uh, this morning on the phone... We've got Yvonne ready to go. Zoe, go ahead. Uh, Yvonne, Zoe's listening. Hello, Zoe. How are you? Good Hello? Thing. Good morning. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, good morning. How can I help you? Look, I've misplaced or lost a set of uh, keys for the side gate key and the garage Uh-oh. and one for the uh, garden shed. 
and I can't get into either because of bad padlocks. On them. Okay, all right. The first thing. This is going to sound very unusual. Um, okay, very quickly. I keep seeing diamonds around you, so this might seem a little bit way off. So there's got to be something to do with the bedroom, um, okay. and I see diamonds. It could also mean that there's actually when, when you sort of asked about the keys, I saw diamond e earrings. Is what I was actually trying to get to. Sorry, a bit tongue tied there. So I actually feel like I would be looking in a jewelry box. Yeah. Somewhere that was accidentally put in a jewelry box. I know that yeah. sounds unusual, but that's exactly where I want to go with to do yeah. the dark set of drawers. So that, that will explain the very day that they went missing. Oh, yeah. yeah. wow. there you go. Well yeah. Okay, yeah. let's go to Vanessa at Glanville now, who's just split up with her partner and wants to know if they'll get back together. Hi, Vanessa. Hi, Dee. How are you? Good, Good morning. Good. So tell yeah, us, we, you, you just split up? Yeah, we split up about a month or so ago. My boys. I've got twin boys and they were giving him a little bit of a hard time, but they absolutely love him and so do I. And we just want to know if we're going to get back together. Okay, there seems to be a lot of, um, again, the first thing, my first instinct is um, a lot of kind of workplace frustration. I do feel like your partner is someone who looks very, very high strung at the moment. So again, yep. you know, I just he seems so tense and I don't feel like he's being valued at work. So then all that sort of stuff seems to be building up. So not making excuses. I would say yep. to you, yes, within the next sort of five and a half months, you guys are going to reconnect. But I really feel like you guys also need to look at your family members who is aggravating your poor husband um, and I don't, mean, don't mean to be grouchy but someone needs to really back off and stop giving him so much pressure but he will reconnect with you guys I actually feel like the key to success hun is trust him he's a good guy Oh, he certainly is. He's yeah. absolutely fantastic. So you guys will be back. So just stay strong, hun, and have faith. He will come back. Good on you, oh, Vanessa. Excellent. Thank you. Bye. Thanks for Thanks, your call. Vanessa. Thank you very much, Zoe. Once again, you can get on to the Medium money. Zoe at mediumzoe.com. That is her website, and we'll see you back in a couple of weeks and all the best.